We present HAIR, a new text-guided strand-based generative model for 3D human hairstyles. Using textual descriptions, HAIR can generate multiple variations of realistic strand-based 3D hairstyles in seconds. The hairstyles produced by our method are fully compatible with widely used computer graphics pipelines. For example, they can be used in virtual environments as simulatable and realistically rendered production-level assets. Our work stands out from the existing text-guided hair generation approaches. Existing methods do not achieve detailed hair geometry and employ surface-based or volumetric representations for hair, which makes them incompatible with the rendering and simulation toolkit available in modern computer graphics engines. Also, the closest work to ours, Tekka, requires hours to reconstruct each hairstyle, making it significantly less practical. We employ a text condition diffusion model to generate the hairstyles in a pre-trained space of latent hair maps. These maps are produced from strand-based hairstyles via a variational autoencoder. To train a conditional diffusion model, we annotate a data set of synthetic hair assets with textual descriptions and use them. However, this model learns to generate latent maps only for the few guiding strands in the hairstyle. During inference, we upsample the generated guiding latent hair maps using our proposed upsampling procedure and decode them into dense hairstyles. For more details, please refer to our paper. While classical upsampling methods work at the level of 3D strands, our approach operates at the level of latent hair maps. Here, we ablate our proposed method and compare it with a strand based upsampling baseline implemented in Blender, a popular computer graphics software. We see that strand-level interpolation produces grid-like artifacts, like hair clumping, or loss of the original structure of hair, especially for curly hairstyles. At the same time, both nearest and bilinear upsampling in the latent space already leads to more plausible results, which are further improved by combining these two approaches and adding noise to produce more realistic renders. To generate descriptions for the synthetic hairstyles, we feed a randomly sampled set of questions into the visual question answering system. These questions are pre-generated with the help of chat GPT and produce a comprehensive description of the hairstyle. The resulting textual descriptions are then encoded and averaged to obtain the resulting hairstyle embedding. The hairstyles produced by our method are ready to be simulated and realistically rendered via off-the-shelf computer graphics software. We show simulation results for bob hairstyle, wavy long hair, and curly short hair using Unreal Engine. These results are much harder to achieve with previous approaches, such as Tika, which rely on implicit hair reconstruction functions and thus require custom simulation tools. Our geometry is also reconstructed at the strand level, thus containing higher frequencies and more details. Using our generative model, we can interpolate between different hairstyles. We do that by conditioning the diffusion model on a linear combination of the text embeddings. Here, we show the interpolation results for several prompt pairs that describe hairstyles that differ in length and texture. Notice that our interpolations preserve the realism of the generated hairstyles and achieve smooth transitions between different pairs. We then showcase the editing capabilities for predefined hairstyles using an off-the-shelf inversion method for the text-guided diffusion model. Given the input hair asset, we produce its latent hair map and invert it using a pre-trained diffusion model. As a result, we obtain a textual conditioning vector corresponding to this hairstyle. Then, we can interpolate between this vector and the embedding of a semantic query to conduct the editing. Notice that our generative model can produce complex editing operations given only textual descriptions while preserving other input features like hair volume. For more details on the procedure we use for semantic editing, please refer to our supplementary materials. Here we showcase the hairstyles generated by our method, along with the fragments of the prompts that were used to generate them. Notice that our method can produce various hairstyles that accurately match the provided descriptions. Lastly, we showcase one of the tentative applications of our method, the text-guided generation of assets for virtual characters. 
Our generated hairstyles can be realistically rendered in arbitrary lighting conditions. They can also be easily simulated, including out-of-the-box resolution of collisions with the body and clothing. We use Unreal Engine in this demo, but our generated hairstyles can be incorporated into any downstream computer graphics-based pipeline. To summarize, our method can generate new strand-based text-guided hairstyles in seconds and perform their semantic editing in minutes, making it highly applicable for human character creation and modeling. For more results, please refer to our paper and supplementary materials.